Hi, my name is Scott Strohs, and this is my SQL Shorts. If we need to clone a table and the data in that table, we can accomplish this in two quick ways. One of them uses a single SQL command, while the other uses two SQL commands. Here, we have a table named user that has columns you might typically find in a table that holds user information. If we want to quickly clone this table with the data into a table named user2, we could use a single command, create table user2 as select star from user. When we run this command, we see an indication that 1,000 rows were affected. If we select the first five rows of this new table, we can see the data matches the result from the user table. While this command copied the basic table structure and the data, it does not copy the complete column definitions. If we look at the structure of the user table, we can see that there are two keys defined and the ID column is auto-incrementing. When we look at the structure of the user2 table, neither of the keys is defined and the ID column is not auto-incrementing. If we want an exact copy of the user table, including all the key definitions, indexes, and other column properties, such as auto increment, we would use create table user three, like user. Now, when we show the table structure of user three, we can see that it's an exact match for the user table. To insert the data from the user table into the user three table, we use the command insert into user three, select star from user. We can see that this command also shows 1,000 affected rows. When we select the first five rows from the user three table, we see it matches the data from the user table. Thanks for watching. Please be sure to hit like and subscribe. Also, there'll be a link in the description for any code or files we use during this video.